Well, new at 11, there's a shortage of priests in southwest Michigan right now. And that has a local bishop making some tough decisions. He met with a local church tonight to talk about changes. WSBT 22's Heather Black is here now. And Heather, how will the new plan help? Well, Rick, the Catholic Diocese of Kalamazoo will assign priests to serve multiple parishes. Now that will allow them to keep churches open while dealing with the declining number of priests. I spoke to the bishop who says these changes are not as bad as they seem. To Hundreds of people showed up at St. Joseph and Bernard Parish in Benton Harbor to hear firsthand about changes coming to their congregation. Trying to, to uh, reorganize a bit so that we have uh, the priests that are available to us uh, being as positioned well as possible to provide pastoral care for the people. Bishop Paul Bradley says these changes are happening because there are only 55 priests to cover 59 parishes. They're also facing an increase in retirements and fewer young men becoming ordained priests. With these changes, priests will serve more than one parish. Within those collaboratives, there might be two or three parishes grouped together. So uh, that means that um, uh, one, pas one pastor will have responsibility for more than one parish, two, likely, probably in some ca many cases, three. Some church members are thankful the problem is being addressed. To me, it was like, I'm glad that they're taking um, a proactive stand on this because this is something that had to be done. But with new changes comes new concerns. Oh, everybody's concerned about, you know, there's going to be changes. Some people are going to lose their priests. Some people are going to lose their, their, their regular mass times. Um, so it's just going to be, uh, everyone's going to have to change. And it takes about six years to become an ordained Catholic priest. Now that means Catholic churches could be facing these issues for the next 15 to 20 years. Priests will get their new assignments around Easter, and they'll start their new schedule on July 1st. And Rick, we have a list of the area churches that will be served by one priest on our WSBT 22 mobile app. Just click on that story.